along Pika Road. I like Garden City. I don't know why but I think to me it's like the best mall along this side of the town. I am here for um, I've come here to check out uh, Victoria Court sale. I had my friend told me that last year's sale she got she got um, a vase for 100 bob. I do not know how true that is but I'm here to just check it out. It is such a random plan. I do not have anything. I did not plan for this. So let's see if I will get myself anything. <laughs> and if not guys come and check out Victoria Court's sale. I'm sure you will have um, something for yourself or you will be able to get something for yourself. So let me talk the rally. do not know if I am um, allowed to film in the mall. Um, so <laughs> if I don't get any footage from inside here, uh, please understand it's a mall and uh, security measured to be, measures to be followed. So if I do not get a footage inside, I will definitely show you what, if I get anything. And if I do not, then I will give you an update of how the sale is and what you can get and at what price. Garden City is my favorite mall. It is because of things like this. Look at this decoration, guys. the only one who got the memo people are outside here waiting for the doors to be opened so that we can get in and get ourselves some nice good things at a fair price at a discounted price yes people are here literally waiting i think i should sit down and give my rant in peace because that is the worst sale i've ever seen in my life hey Ati, i think i should just get a place sit down and talk to you guys because it was not a good sale. No, I refuse. I refuse. Okay, it was a bit fair. I do not disagree. But I think that they will have done better. Considering it's a sort of big company. Yeah? Actually, it's a big company. I really think they should have done better in terms of their sales. I will give the update when I get home. Right now, I just want to dash home. See you, Papa. So, stay tuned. Vlog. So, I got home a while ago and I walked in into an event. I have a nephew who is graduating, who was going through the rites of passage, and now he's a man. And now we're celebrating now. Uh, so, that's the. Daniya! Shugli, I've been up to since I came to, to home. Any. My mom will Asha. let me vlog in peace, in peace. Anyway, uh, so that's what we are doing right now, just getting ready for the event before it starts. It's currently three people are running a bit late, but um, I know it will be okay. I will give you a small um, is it snippet. I'm a snippet of the event, so stick around for that. Bye. <laughs> In Akuru, I know I promised to give my rant about the Victoria Court sale and I've been postponing this thing for quite some time because I've been busy traveling and also settling down, just um, resting myself out because of the fatigue over the weekend. And now I'm here. Um, so the Victoria Court sale was on Saturday, if you 
don't know now you know <laughs> it may show peter um it was about the, the small stools as you can see i think i'll insert a picture over here or over here um so they wrote on their instagram page that the sale will be on a first come first first come first served basis huh? so when we got there okay i got there among the first people i don't know <laughs> but when we got there i think they did not have enough stools to give because i expected that when we walk in people pay and then um people pay and then they get if if you come later if you don't get the stools i think they're called the cologne stools if you come later and find the stools that are not there then you'll know that you have automatically missed out on the sale but now we were so many i think they did not know how to handle us so they had a small raffle ticket which i think was fair by the way um so they all they whatever they put the numbers in a small bowl and then people had to come pick the numbers and the lucky winners got to work away with the cologne stools now i tend to think if you're carrying out a sale you should have whatever you are selling in the shop these guys did not have the cologne stools in the shop so they will they wouldn't have afforded to like um serve the customers on a first come first served basis because the stools were not there in the first place so that is why we had to carry out the raffle ticket thing so that those that win will be um will get the stools on a later date you get my point because they were not there at the time of the sale i'm thinking that is such a disorganization when you're having a sale please make sure that whatever you're selling is in the store other than that i did not get to <laughs> walk away with anything because <laughs> i'm not I, I am not lucky when it comes to all these sales and raffle tickets i am just not i don't know but i thought that day will be my day but apparently it was still not my day um uh, so yeah that's just about it yeah? thank you for watching this video thank you for staying tuned kindly subscribe if you've not subscribed L click on that red button down there that is written subscribe then click on the bell so that you will be notified whenever i post a new video also like leave me a comment let me know what you think has this ever happened to you have you ever worked in a sale and you found that the, the sale is not as you intended it or the sale whatever they were selling is not there it is not available i know probably i'm not the only one eh? leave me a comment let me know what you think let me know if you've gone through the same thing and also shout out this video if you like it let's get this vlog to 500 subscribers guys that is all i'm asking for for now <laughs> till next time guys see you stay positive stay woke stay happy and enjoy your christmas till next time see you guys bye <laughs>